Look at how the Democrats are literally beyond Joseph McCarthy, where 1,500 Hollywood people, the New York Times reported three weeks ago, are in a secret society of libertarians and conservatives. And now the IRS is trying to find out a list of names to persecute them. I knew about the secret society five years ago. They call it a secret society. All it is is conservatives meeting in secret, talking about ways to try to put libertarian ideas, or really the libertarians, into films, movies. Uh, I went and saw a nut job with my children a few weeks ago, and I guarantee you that's a libertarian made that. It's all about Agenda 21, all about the government controlling the food, all about food stamps. Really a good movie for your children to see, I think. And the fact is, if I was a liberal, communist, socialist, well-meaning person, not one of the social engineer types, I would be freaked out if libertarians and conservatives were being persecuted. When Bush did a little bit of persecution, I came out against him real hard. And I called for Bush's impeachment over the NSA spying. And things like that. It's just that now, who can deny that under Obama, it is just off the charts? And they want to have the moral high ground where they can run scam energy deals in Benghazi and persecute people with the NSA and the IRS. And now they're back with the IRS persecuting people and have this reign of terror and, and, and be arresting filmmakers and persecuting people. This is real. This is real. They want to keep media on a short leash. Symbols are powerful, and the globalists have hijacked the symbols of America. They've turned them into their own symbols. Well, we are restoring the idea of the true republic, not the counterfeit globalist empire, by promoting the icon George Washington and others. That's why we're rolling out on a 100% made in America line of incredible pro-liberty apparel. We are repopularizing liberty. We are helping fellow Americans rediscover what made this country great. We are the spirit of 1776. We are 1776 worldwide. We are all brothers and sisters in arms in the animating contest of liberty in the long march towards humanity's ultimate destiny of freedom. Visit MadeIn1776.com today and vote with your dollars to promote truly made in America high quality products and promote the ideals of liberty.